Hi all of you I'm Vijay Krishna Sayer senior software developer and trainer I have 6 plus years of experience in the software development and training we are going to discussing about how to uninstall SQL server first of all go to control panel so go to programs here go to programs and features after that here you can see that microsoft sql server 2019 64 bit my pc is 64 bit i install 64 bit your pc is 32 bit able to see that 32 bit now here i am double click on this here you can able to see that add repair remove here i am select the remove so whatever the instance is installed in your pc so that will be able to see display here so previously sql express ins installed in this pc now here i am click on next here select all here the, again i click on next here again you need to select remove so completely all these things are uninstalled except some sub support files are not uninstalled so database engine services sql browser writer so the main sql server components was uninstalled now i click on close here next after that so go back and again open programs and features here i am again i click on uninstall uh, so again i click on remove here see here if you see here here there is no next option why because it is already uninstalled so then click on again cancel so no it is uninstalled successfully but the next thing is you can able to see the sql server management studio so here i am i'm searching about sql server management studio so still you can able to see the management studio here it is not uninstalled so after uninstalling sql server all components you should be uninstall sql server management studio also in the same programs and features here i can able to select the see microsoft sql server management studio 18.10 version so now i double click on this so here uninstall option is there here i click on uninstall so the setup is uninstalled completely then click on close here after that again here type sql server management studio see the folder is able to see but the software is not unable to see here so it is successfully uninstalled after successfully uninstall that software you need to restart your pc so thank you very much we will see you in the next video